Right. So it was the Sian forces that ravaged this area? Yes. Many troops remained here with no orders after Malos sank their homeland. We're doing our best to disarm them, but... Well, you've seen the village. Sadly, it's happened more than once. The powers that be bicker among themselves, ignoring the larger danger. And right now, that is the one thing we cannot afford. I will go take a look. Incidentally, how has Torna been faring? I'd like to tell you that the people bask in the peace of His Majesty's rule. But I'm afraid that would be a lie. Same as everywhere else, then. Yes? Torna has not escaped Malos's rampage unscathed. If that is so, allow me to offer you the Imperial Army's assistance in this time of... Don't worry about it. This is exactly the reason why Indol entrusted her to me. Ah, so you came. The future king of Torna. I'm glad I thought to send a messenger. King, don't joke about it. Rumors like that could cause trouble at home. I am merely a quester. I hold no such influence. I quest it today, but tomorrow. The core's color is different. And she's a woman, too. Mm. Quite lovely indeed. Malos was all brawn and brutish strength. You worry? No, quite the contrary. Everybody knows a blade's appearance bears no relation to their power. You could be the heroine of our resistance. No, I won't be anyone's anything. That's fine now. I have only one thing to ask of you. To rectify the mistake I made and erase Malos from the face of the world. So that's why the returning hero, pacifier of the Borderlands, was really just... Never before has a blade broken free and rampaged like this. I can see why Indol would prefer to keep it quiet. They're even rooting support to the militia through Argentum for deniability. And then towards you. I'm just some princeling. Me. Surely, if you defeat Malos, your cover will be blown. If, indeed. But we're not in it for the glory, are we? When we're done, I'll just plow my fields in peace. Your Majesty, some of our troops have returned to base, but... Is something wrong? They're all reporting something strange. A marauding group of routed mercenaries, trying to avoid any attention. Just remnants, hmm? That is strange. There's not much around here for them, in the way of paid work or opportunities for looting. As your majesty commanded, our men did not engage. We confirmed their bearing, then withdrew. And? Where were they going? The village outskirts. But why there? There's nothing but graveyards. <laughs> what the? Oh, no. At first, I thought to take it, but I'd made it for her.
and I'd like her to keep it forever. So, the bitch is dead, is she? Shame. I had a soft spot for her. Guess you learned how to use a weapon at least. Big change from a tiny kid trying not to piss herself in fear. You're... No! God! You remember me? How touching. Face that ugly, I couldn't forget. Trust me, I tried. Hush. What do you want? Not that I can't imagine. I'm here to take back what's mine, kid. But before that, I'll take a bit of time to express my gratitude to you. It ain't gonna be pretty or quick. Watch as I cut you into little sticky chunks, just to make sure the last thing he feels is complete despair. I'll hold them up. You get to the others quickly. No use. Hayes, he knew about you. He brought no blades, just more marks. Exactly. Don't worry. I'm gonna treat you real good before I get to the cut. Piss me off. Oi! Surround them so they don't get away. My lady, you have to go. It's all right. He's here. You bastard! No! Next, then. Right leg? Or the left? Or how about. <laughs> enough! That's enough, Jim. 
Just leave him. For my sake. So you let him go. Even without his arms, he may cause you more trouble. One day. I didn't want to end it here. He might deserve it, but he did take care of my mother, so... Mm. Let's go back. I suppose I can bring myself to step foot on this flagship, after all. Ah! My arms! My arms! Bastards! I'm... I'm gonna kill them! Every last one of them! Are you?